I'm going to tell you something that may rock your world. And I apologize in advance. Not really. Manifestations are not intended to make you happy. You think they are. I think they are. I think if I just have this thing, like I, my stomach is growling, if I could just eat this food, this whatever, then I would be happy. And you know, maybe for a, a quick meal that might work. But the reason manifestations don't make you happy is because you have to be happy before you get the manifestation. You want something that you think will make you happy. We all do. It's human nature. It's how we're programmed. But you think, if I could just get that job, that house, that person, that place, that experience, that body, that food, that, 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 that. From a place of feeling less than, you think grabbing onto that manifestation would pull you up to that level. The man, Grabbing onto that manifestation, think of it like a kite or a balloon. If I could just grab that string, it could pull me up to that next level and I would be living from that next level. But you know what? It doesn't work that way. You have to find a way to live from that next level before you have access to that manifestation. And you know what happens? If you're already living at the level, the vibrational level of that thing that you wanted from a lower vibration that you thought was going to make your world rock, was going to rock your world. If you're already living at that level and the manifestation is there, it's as exciting as the elevator door opening on the second floor and you walking out onto the second floor of a department store. Not very exciting, is it? It's just you walk out like everywhere else, but the elevator brought you there. So once you can get your vibration to be a vibrational equivalence to the thing that you desire, it's going to be like a, lot of, of, of elevator door opening and you just walk out like nothing, no big deal. But you're probably already wanting to be on the third floor by then. And you're thinking, if I could just get on the third floor now, that would be the experience that would really rock my world. And the same truth works there. You can't get the third floor until your vibrational match, your vibrational match to the third floor. That's why manifestations cannot make you happy. Because by the time you get that manifestation, you are already living from that vibrational level. And so it's nothing, it's no big deal. That's why Abraham teaches Feel good now. Get happy first and then the manifestation will come. But I believe most people have this um, longing or this fascination with manifestation because they really still think that manifestation is going to fill the gap in their heart, fill the gap in their life, fill the gap in whatever they're lacking in their life. And it never will. You can try. Go ahead. It never will fill your heart. You have to find a way to feel good now and source will be your guide. I hate to bring it to you, but if you can, man, if you can swallow this truth and really live it, you'll stop chasing the magic, like magic laser pointer of this manifestation, that manifestation, this car, that car, this, 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 and live happily ever after because everything you want, you want because you think it'll make you happy. So just get happy now and cut out the middleman. Hee. <laughs>